I'm here with John Sebi, Development Director of the Salvation Army. John, thanks for sharing your time with us. Thank you, Michael. We're just wondering how you use donations that come into the Salvation Army. Well, the great thing about the Salvation Army is all the donations you make here in the Greater Augusta area stays right here. Helps people in need throughout the Greater CRSA. Uh, goes to our homeless shelter, our soup kitchen, our job skills training program, our financial assistance program. Uh, we have so many programs right now that are touching a lot of lives. How many people do you serve during the year? Thousands. Uh, every night we house over 100 men, women, and children. In fact, we've had an explosion of children. We usually average 15 to 20, I mean, we usually average 12 to 15 children a night. Mm -hmm. We average 29 to 30 kids every night. Wow. Um, we feed uh, 250, 300 meals a day in our soup kitchen. Uh, so we help thousands every year through our various programs. And total during the year, how many do you serve? It's like 20,000 lives that we touch right here in the greater CRSA. And what is the area that you serve? How many counties or whatever? Uh, Burke County, Richmond County, Aiken County, um, uh, uh, Columbia County. Uh, we serve the greater CRSA. Uh -huh. And uh, what is the budget for the Salvation Army during the year? Uh, we have here just in the Center of Hope, we have actually have three budgets. We have the uh, Croc Center budget, which is all separate for Croc Center mm -hmm. uh, programs. Then the, the Greater uh, Area Command has a separate budget. Uh, so all those monies are kept separate. And that's where the kettles go to, the mayo appeal go to. Uh, then we have a Thrift Star, Family Star budget, which also is our Family Stars and a Drug and Alcohol Rehabilitation Program. Uh, the shelter budget all year is about $5 million. Mm -hmm. How is uh, giving trending during this holiday season? Is it up? Is it down? About the same? It was, it's pretty funny. Um, we started off with a great kettle kickoff, but through November it went way down, and then we've been catching up. So last year we're running neck and neck. General giving, major gifts and uh, mail appeal, is actually up for November. Of course, the big key is how December does. The majority of our funding for the Salvation Army comes into the month of December. So December really is going to tell how much we can impact we can have throughout the rest of this year. So December is really key and, and there's still time for us to help. Absolutely. Uh, these year-end gifts, these December gifts uh, are like 50% of our income as in this month. Wow. So how can people give? They can go online to Salvation Army Augusta and there's a donate button and just give online. Call 1-800-SAL-ARMY uh, and you can uh, do it on the phone or just mail your check to 1384 Green Street, Augusta, Georgia 30901. Okay, that address again is? 1384 Green Street, Augusta, Georgia 30901. And last question, are there other fundraisers during the year that you depend on heavily that people should put on their calendars? Absolutely. Uh, the biggest one is going to be the Taste of the Master Chefs, which is April 7th. Uh, all the proceeds of this will come to the Salvation Army in Augusta. Uh, last year was their inaugural great event, huge turnout. Uh, Sergio Garcia showed up, who ended up winning the Masters. Um, so that's a huge event. Wow. And then, of course, we have our annual, uh, three times a year, is our auto auction. Our next one will be February 3rd. We do three a year in uh, February June and October, and people donate their cars, vehicles, trucks, motorcycles, and we auction them off, and all the money, again, stays right here in the CRSA. That's awesome. Thank you, John, so much. Appreciate it. You're very welcome. Give to the Salvation Army. It's a real key this December to do. Thank you so much.